or y'all hold sleep, okay? If y'all ain't, I'm gonna need y'all to wake the hell up, boo. Cause y'all know we family. Y'all like my girls, you know what I'm saying? So whenever some bullshit pops off, you know that I gotta be the first one to come and chime in on this motherfucking shit. I've been around over through this piece. Excuse me, girl. But um, the juice man was hungry and uh, he wanted a burger and some fries. And I ain't gonna lie, I ate one of them damn french fries. I sure the fuck did, boo. I'm not even gonna lie like that. But girl, I just left the nail salon and I got a fucking rent about them motherfuckers in the nail salon. Just in case y'all want to see my nails, this is what my nails are, are looking like. I don't know if the true color is showing up, but it's kind of looking orange on this camera. But they not orange, they like a, a pinky type of color. But anyway, girl, okay, I should have known from the last time that I went in the nail salon last week or the week before last or whatever day it was. What the hell is that on my shirt? I went in the nail salon to get my toes done. I got a pedicure and all that shit. You know it's springtime, bitch. Um, ain't nobody got time to be um, walking around here uh, uh, with their feet looking all extra cruddy and shit. That's the ladies. Number one rule do not walk around with your feet looking extra cruddy when you got on sandals and shit. Cause I'm I'm a sandal type of chick um, in the in the spring and in the summertime. You know I I like to I'm I'm a sandal girl. So uh, I decided I wanted to go in there. I wanted to get me some nails. You know because I've been painting my nails and stuff. And you know I'm I'm a kind of a nail girl when it comes to the spring and the summer and stuff like that. So I decided to get my nails done. And then of course you know they sit up there with the whole. Um, you want pedicle? You got boyfriend? They come in with that bullshit. You got boyfriend? They want? They try to have small talk with you. And I'm not trying to talk, you know, too much shit about them. But I mean, that's just how they do. They make small talk and then they offer you extra shit. That's what they do. That's their job. They're, they're them, them some motherfucking marketers. That's what they do, girl. So while she's doing my my nails now, mind you, let me tell you what happened when I first went in there. Of course, when you first walk in and ask you, you know, what um, can I help you? They're like, what are you going to get today? I'm like, I want a full set, um, blah, 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 blah. So this chick comes out of the back. I should have known something. This bitch comes out of the back and she got on, she got some fucking headphones in her ear and she walking with her iPad. Now, mind you, you know, I'm not trying to be funny, but she wasn't even Chinese, Korean, whatever they are. She was, I don't know what she was, but she was speaking in Chinese. So, some just didn't seem right to me about this motherfucker. So, she's going to ask this chick. She was like, go down to number six. And this chick proceeds to come over. And she, I'm, I'm assuming she was the one that was going to do my nails. Keyword, going to. So, um, I tell her, I said, I want the stiletto nails like that. And then, of course, she looks up at the other lady because she don't understand what the fuck I'm saying, naturally. So, the lady was like, oh, um, well, you can move to number two. Because she had to do it. Because apparently, the lady didn't even know what the fuck stiletto nails is. Which further lets me know that this motherfucker shouldn't have never been in the nail salon to begin with. But you don't know what a stiletto nail is, bitch. You do not belong in the nail salon. Okay? Doing nobody nail. If you don't know what the fuck I mean when I say stiletto nails. And once I said stiletto, if you didn't really understand what I'm saying, when the other lady said, okay, stiletto, and for you to not be able to do it, then you don't need to be in the fucking nail salon. You do not need to be doing anyone's nails, ma'am. So, um, the other lady proceeds to do my nails, which I like her anyway, because I go to that nail salon from time to time. Normally, I like to use the same person, but they had a lot of people in there, so I was like, okay, I was going to use this chick, but she, thankfully, she didn't know how to do the stiletto nails, but... While the other lady is sitting there doing my nails, she, you know, of course, like I said, she's trying to make small talk. She's like, you want pedicure? You want gel nail? Of course, I was just going to get the regular nails because the shit is cheap. But, you know, I'm a cheap motherfucker. I'm a frugal motherfucker. So I was just going to get, you know, the cheap ass nails. She was like, but of course, you know, I know I've had gel nails before and I know they last a little bit longer. So I was like, yeah, let me get the gel nails. Okay. Cool. No problem. So, of course, she's like, you want pedicure too? I'm like, how much extra is a pedicure? She's like, $25. I'm like, all right, cool, whatever. So, um, once she had, you know, did my nails, she cut them down, you know, in the in the, the, the stiletto design or whatever, she tells me to go head over to the, you know, thing to get my pedicure because there were so many people in there and everybody likes for that lady that was doing my nails to do their nails because she she's good. Um, so, next thing I know, Miss Ma'am, the one, the same one that came from the back with her damn iPad and her earbuds and proceeds to come from the back bitch are you on break all day you know what i'm saying i'm gonna tell y'all about something else too that she fucking did but i'm like bitch are you on break all day you just walking around skinning and grinning and laughing and shit watching looking at your ipad when all these damn people in here which i see why she won't be in there long because somebody gonna cuss her ass out and i'm explain why so i'm sitting down in the 
you know, the thing getting my pedicure and everything. I got, you know, they ran the water, put the little thing in there, you know, the, the soften up your feet and shit. So she comes over. The bitch, she don't even know how to speak English. The lady, of course, she don't know how to speak English, but at least the other ladies understand how to fucking decipher what you're trying to say a little bit. You know what I'm saying? So I'm sitting there. She's, still, you know, she's basically slinging my feet back and forth in the damn water. And I'm like, damn, bitch, you're being a little aggressive. I'm not saying that to her, but that's what I'm thinking to myself. So um, she's doing my feet, doing my feet. Now, mind you, it was two other ladies that was getting a pedicure, too. Now, this one lady, I love for her to do my pedicures because she, she's very thorough when it comes to, you know, scraping all that shit off your feet and all that type of stuff. She's very thorough with that. But on, on this particular day, like I said, they decided, I guess they were so busy, they wanted to bring this bitch out of, out of retirement, whatever the fuck she come from. So she's over there doing my fucking feet. The same, like I said, the same one. I'm going to get to the story, but I'm just, I'm so fucking, I'm frustrated right now from fucking with this damn lady. I wanted to cock block in her fucking throat. So she's getting the thing. She's not even really removing the dead skin from my feet. You know how they get that fucking thing to look like a cheese grater and they do all this different stuff. They're supposed to put the softening and stuff on your feet then do all this. This bitch didn't do any of that. Those other two ladies that were sitting in their chairs, they was in their chairs for 30, not 30 minutes, probably about 15 minutes getting their little situation done. Getting all the little, you know, the little strays, dead skin off your, off them around your toenail and all that stuff. This bitch got through with my feet so fucking fast. And then she proceeds to paint it. I'm like, cause I'm like, okay, bitch, just hurry up and do my fucking feet so I can get out from over here. Cause number one, she was just slanging my fucking foot without saying, okay, put it in the water, put it out of the water, whatever. Like the other ladies was doing. I mean, at least I can understand in the water, out the water, at least do that shit. You know what I'm saying? So then she proceeds to paint my toenails. Cool. She puts the little stuff between my toes and then she puts the, you know, the, the flip flap, the little sandal thing on my feet. She does that. Then she proceeds to paint them. Now, the polish that I chose for my toes is kind of a light polish. It's not that vibrant or whatever. So, you naturally, you're going to have to use multiple coats. She proceeds to paint one coat. Now, mind you, the way that she's painting my toes is some shit that, like, my little 16-year-old niece would do. She don't really know how to paint no toes. So, she's just going all over the place. Now, the polish, like I said, is a light color. So, it's streaky. She goes over it one time. Of course, it's streaky. She goes over it again. It's still streaky. I'm like, um, okay, ma'am, it's still streaky. Because she was about to put the top coat on. She was like, that's two coats. I'm like, I don't give a damn if it's four coats. It's still streaky. You can still see my fucking nail. You can't, the color is barely there. I don't give a damn how many coats you put. I know it's probably y'all pilot procedure to put two coats, but bitch, you put it on there until my fucking heart's content. Boo. I mean, goddamn. So she puts another coat on there and then she does another coat on my other toes and then she proceeds to put the top coat on my uh, uh, uh my left feet put the top coat on my left feet and then the bitch is gonna sit there and tell me okay you can come over i'm like you didn't even put a top coat on my damn right feet lady like are you fucking serious are you fucking serious so <clears throat> she she comes back and she puts top coat on my other my on my right feet and then of course she's sitting there talking all that over there i'm looking at her like bitch Buck around and say some shit that I can sort of kind of understand. I am going to whop a chop your ass in your fucking neck. That is how pissed off that lady had me. I'm spending all of this money up in here. Bitch, you are going to do my feet correctly. Okay? I'm, I'm not giving you no type of attitude. I'm being extra nice. But you want to give me all types of fucking attitude, boo. No. You will not on today. I'm spending my money in no, your fuck, fucking establishment. The least you can do is paint my fucking toes correctly without having a fucking attitude so once she's done i go back over to the lady that was doing my stilettos the one that i told you is good i don't know why my eyes are showing pretty like brown girl i don't know maybe because i'm frustrated for being in that goddamn place because my eyes are normally like pearly white but um bitch i done lost my fucking train of thought shit but I went back over to the other lady that was doing my stiletto nails. The one I told you was pretty good. So she's doing my nails and she's painting them or whatever. Now, mind you, this woman, the polish I got on my nails is pretty light as well. She had to use multiple coats of this. That lady used I don't know how many coats with no problem. I didn't even have to ask her because she could clearly tell that the shit was still, you could see through it, it was streaky. So naturally, she was going to use multiple coats of paint with no problem. But where she fucked up at... She sat there and um, it, there was a big ass bubble on my nail. And I was like, oh, it's a bubble on there. And she was like, 
Oh, that's not a bubble. It was, it was a big ass knot like bubble thing. So she's going to get, after she's done after that and cured that and put it in the, you know, the, the cure thing or whatever. She's going to tell me, um, oh, that's nothing. That's just, you know, the, the polish. I'm like, yeah, but it's a big ass knot on top of my nail. So she proceeds to get her, um, the fingernail file and file it down. Now, when she filed it down, she told me, have a nice day. So I'm thinking to myself, okay, cool. And then I, cause I couldn't really tell inside. But when I went outside, I'm like, this shit looked like she scraped all the polish off of it and told me, have a nice day. So I come back in and I'm like, look at this nail. So she's like, okay, I put more uh, color on it. So she put some more color on it and then she put another top coat on it. But the one that I told you was doing my toes, how about she was sitting next to the girl um, looking at her iPad again with her headphones on, laughing up a fucking storm. All those people was in there waiting. So this girl that um, I was talking to while I was getting my toes done, her friend had came in there and she was like, yeah, I, you know, she was sitting there waiting. The, her, her friend was waiting to get her nails done. And the lady was like, um, you, you getting nail polish? She was like, yeah. She said, I told, you know, her that she wanted her nails polished. She was like, but I guess she was on break. And she was talking about the lady that, uh, uh, fucked my nails up basically. And I looked at her, I was just like, you do not want this fucking lady to polish your toes. The one that was walking, the one that was walking around with her fucking iPad and shit, uh, uh, hooping and hollering, laughing and shit. Like she was at the crib. I said, you don't want this woman to polish your toes. Let me tell you what this woman had did. After the lady told her um, to polish the people's uh, hands, that lady got her fucking iPad, went and sat in one of the chairs that you sit in when you finna get your pedicure and started watching her fucking movie, Kiki and Kaka. And that lady was like, I guess she on break. Bitch, it was literally 10 o'clock in the morning. You, you just got here. Are you for serious, y'all? Let me get this money out of this bank. Go home and feed this hungry ass man and start back to work and family. Look, that, that's why I stay the fuck up out of the nail salon. I got another video that I need to make a little bit later, but bitch, I just had to come and tell y'all that motherfucker. Ooh, Lord Jesus.